Hi friends, this is Asrar. In this session, we will discuss about how to link to other pages in ASP.NET. As many people are asking to make a video on this title. So look at this. This is a CSS drop down menu in which I am going to explain when I am going to click the about menu, it will redirect to about us page and likewise uh, when I click mobile, laptop, computer and contact, it will redirect to the particular pages. So look at this, I have a code as a, I have created div inside that I have created another list, list items and the anchor tags. So I have to set a URL in the anchor tag. This is anchor tag in which I have to set a URL in the href equal to. So href stands for hyperlink reference. So in the in this place I have to set a URL. For example, you can set any URL to this link as now I'm going to set default dot aspx which is my default page this is the default page and this is the home so if I refresh and when I click the home menu it will redirect to default page itself so likewise I am going to create about us page and it won't redirect because I don't have a about us page in my project so first I'm going to create a about us page uh, contact page and in the product I will create one page itself and so just copying this page and pasting here this is for about page and this is for contact and this is for product mobile so first I'm going to rename it as about then this one too I'm going to rename as contact and this one I'm going to redirect as sorry rename as mobile so after creating the pages I'm just going to set the URL in the anchor tag as about dot html and in the product I have a mobile anchor tag so in this I am going to set sorry it is not a html it is a aspx so dot aspx and in the mobile so I go to set mobile dot aspx and in the contact anchor tag I am going to set contact dot aspx just saving it now I am going to refresh my browser after that when I click about menu it will redirect to about page so just look out this while hovering here the notification bar will show you as about.aspx so just I'm going to click this one it will redirect and you can see here this about.aspx likewise I'm going to click a contact page so I have not set contact page so just saving it or in the about us page I didn't have s I didn't save the contact links like all so in code there is not uh, URL I have set so just going to replace this just copying and going to replace this link and refreshing the about page itself and in this I will when I click uh, contact it will redirect to contact page so we don't know which page is inactive so we have to set a class called active in the list items so I'm going to create a class in the list items as class equal to active so in CSS I'm going to create a class as in the nav bar I have a class called active inside that I have an anchor tag and for this I'm going to set while hovering the effects should be inactive so just copying and pasting it and just simply saving it and going to refresh sorry redirecting to home page 
it will show that it is in active mode likewise about us while well, I'm going to about us page it should be active so for that I have to set active for this list items class equal to active so just saving it and going to refresh and now while clicking the about us page does not came because active oh I have not called the class active class in that particular page so just have to copy this one and paste here it will show you active in the about us page like home we are active in home page and if we click about it shows that it is active so this is how we can set uh, links to a particular page using the menu. Hope this will help you.